Okay, so welcome to the tutorial on how to create the digital football card. What you see here is highlighted in green and these are the areas that you uh, need to change. So the order will give you all the details, but so the first one is um, position, uh, overall number and logo, which is up here, overall number, position and logo. So you can see here, striker, so that's the position. So we want to change that to um, central attacking midfielder is what the order says and the main number here the main number he wants is uh, 99 so that's that done there if you do need to change the logo the logo is here and you would just simply drag and drop the logo that is required into the position I've already done that so that's just a simple case of that so that's just putting it in there and shrinking it into position and that's how you uh, change the logos around you then come down to the player name which is in this case Connor Lehman now if the name's too big, you might have to reduce the size. Um, so if you've got a particularly long name, you just need to make it uh, fit. So I can't think of the longest name, but the longest name I can. So that's too long, all right? So you would then just simply need to change that down to smaller font. Okay? Easy as that. So that's the name. The next thing you move on to is the stats. And very straightforward, it's the stats numbers only. We're not changing uh, anything else, it's just the stats numbers. So the first one there is the pace number stat, which is this one here. And we want to change that to uh, 95. Uh, again, the order will tell you exactly that. So you're going to end up just clicking on what is required to be changed. 89. Seventy. Right, the last thing you need to do is obviously change the photo out. So that's just down under here. So it's, this one's a little bit tricky in this particular case. I've, I've used uh, to, to brighten up the photo. Okay, but you don't need that. Um, you just simply need to create a clipping mask for here. So again, you would just simply drag and drop your photo into position all right you obviously need to create that clipping mask so you just drop it in under there that creates the clipping mask and then you simply position it into place this one's not too bad but if you needed to you can stretch it into position to make it suit and that's it's really head and shoulders shot is what you're going for so somewhere about there is about perfect and you would simply then save that as a JPEG. So save it as a JPEG and away you go. That's how you create a digital football card.